And we're just asking our Republican colleagues to stop the political stunts. That was an embarrassment last night. A complete embarrassment. Marjorie Taylor Greene, who's basically running the House Republican Conference, shows up in campaign paraphernalia. And then these people want to lecture Joe Biden because he delivered a strong and forceful speech that made them uncomfortable because he exposed their lies and shamelessness. We have one message for extreme MAGA Republicans who want to lecture us about the quorum. Get lost. You're a joke. <coughs> Exhibit A, Marjorie Taylor Greene. Exhibit B, George Santos. Looks like shade is going all around the Democratic caucus. <laughs> I'm here for it. Listen, I was mad. We were all mad. Y'all probably couldn't see it because they weren't necessarily focused in on us. But we were um, looking at the sergeant at arms and we're like, yo, like kick her out, like get rid of her. Um, and our, our the former person that had that role was a black woman. And we were like, if Miss Joyce was here, Miss Joyce would have made sure that the Capitol Police went and rounded her up like Miss Joyce did not play. And so for people that don't know, we are not allowed per our rules to wear any hats, whether you're wearing a cowboy hat or definitely no baseball caps. Like you are not allowed to do that. And the rules also no campaign, no campaign Correct. stuff. Correct. So I was going there too. So the, so the thing is this, she was a double whammy, right? And the fact that she just sat there and she basically told him, well, you can find me, like whatever. I'm not leaving. I'm not taking it off. And it was absolutely ridiculous. But this is who she is. She has never felt as if the rules apply to her. And again, when we start talking about what privilege looks like, it looks like this trailer trash chick from Georgia who somehow is a member of Congress, but baby, she has not left the trailer trash in Georgia. She brings it to the floor every single day and she does not care about the rules. And for some reason, she still has a hold on this Republican Party. These people who supposedly are real politicians are following behind this fool. 